along with yogic practices, being in touch with earth and other elements of life would make life very strong. And it's important that you live strong. Living strong does not mean just all muscle kind of strength. The essential structure of life within you must be strong, not just for the sake of health, not just for the sake of countering external invasions of bacteria, virus and other ailments, but even for the spiritual process, it's very important that you have a strong and stable physical system so that when you fire up your energies, if you open up your genius, it should not hurt. Having a very stable platform of one's physical structure, when I say physical structure, it includes the body and also the energetic system. If you have a strong basis, then taking this high will become possible. Only if the earth that you stand on is stable, will you want to rise high. If where you stand is not stable, the stage on which you are is not stable, forget about dancing, you're not even going to walk. You will be so scared, you will want to lie down because it's unstable. So, we see this everywhere, a whole lot of human beings who raise their performance of life by touching a chord of genius within themselves, unfortunately, suffer enormous instabilities, profound sufferings. So many artists have committed suicide. So many are suffering with mental disabilities. This is essentially because they touched a chord of their genius and the overflow of genius will cause enormous damage to them simply because they did not create a strong and stable base. Creating a strong and stable life, living strong is very important. For this, there are practices of course, but apart from that, being in touch with the five elements of nature, earth, water, air, fire and akash. Without this, you will not strengthen the body these days, Everybody living in small cubicles where temperature is always uh, 69 or 70 degrees Fahrenheit is not the way to live. It's very important that you are exposed to the ways of the world. When I say ways of the world, I am not talking about what's happening in Mumbai, New York or Los Angeles, not those kind of ways. The ways of the world are like this. There is wind, there is chill, there is water, there is this air, there is fire, all these things are there. It is very, very important that you are exposed to the ways of the world. Let's get this expression right. The ways of the world are not the ways that we create. The ways of the world is the way the world is. To be in touch with that, very, very important. To spread out human populations so that they don't have to live in cubicles of uh, so-called comfort, which is weakening the very system, it is important to create a very strong life within you. Only if you do this, your ability to rise in terms of creativity, in terms of activity and for highest levels of spiritual experience also, you need a stable body, otherwise when you rise, something will collapse. It's my wish and my blessing. Every one of you must live strong.